Oh, boy. Can you guys hear? Is everything good? Okay. So, who wants to order Tom Brady a pizza? Which one of you guys want to go to PapaJohns.com and order a pizza for me? Well, what do you recommend? Who wants to order me a pizza in general? I'm not, I'm not doing pizza. I, I know what that'll do to my stomach. No, I'm asking one of the stream monsters who, which one of them wants to order me a pizza. <laughs> All right. So, incoming Soul Calibur 5. This is just going to be one quick. No, uh, well, yeah, we're kind of on break just while we switch over games. Soul Calibur 5 is currently live. Um, just one quick match between GE VSM Fantasy Zero and GE Miles. We'll have some big names here for MK. MK is tomorrow, guys. MK is tomorrow. Make sure you tune in tomorrow at 3 p.m. We go live with Mortal Kombat. I will gladly play some casuals after this for oh, a pizza. Well, here's, what we're, here's what we're doing. Only tomorrow. for a pizza. Immediately following Soul Calibur 5, we will have the Third Strike Challenge. Okay. The 3S Challenge. It costs $1 to enter. One dollar. And the rest is throwing a grand of the pool at CEO, not at this tournament. That's CEO. Yes, we will have MK2 and UMK3 tomorrow. Tomorrow is all day Mortal Kombat on this stream. Let's get to the chase here. What about the pizza, Phil? I don't know. The pizza's up to you. I think someone on this stream. Who? Uh, no one on this stream wants to get me a pizza? What's the matter, guys? Is it uh, playing or? Man... I don't even know what that is. There we go. I see a PS3. I think I'm going to go to Subway or something after this. Man, I am so thirsty, it's not even funny. I really need like a giant gallon of water. I'm starving. I'm Phil. Nice to meet you, starving. I am starving. Lots of fuzzy stuff coming up on the stream. So while it's doing that. I doubt he wants to order a pizza. While it's doing that, make sure you double check our other stream at On The Edge 2, twitch.tv slash bifuteki. Give him a look. He's uh, doing AE and Marvel today, followed by, well, he was supposed to do Super Turbo, but I don't think we're going to, we didn't get any entries for Super Turbo, which really sucks. But I know that Blue Nine wanted to play, so we'll see. Maybe later on tonight, while you guys are doing Mortal Kombat, maybe I'll do a first to ten over on Beef and Techie's stream with uh, Blue Nine. We'll see. Maybe. Make sure you check out the Gamer's Edge, thegamersedgerepair.com, here at 413 Rockaway Avenue in Valley Stream. They fix pretty much anything you need. Come on over, play some Mortal Kombat with us on Thursday nights, too. And as you can see, we finally... Oh, you want to order a pizza? Are you really going to order a pizza? I'll give you the address. If you're really going to get me a pizza, I'll order the address. You're going to you're going to order you're going to pay for me to get a pizza? Oh boy. If you're really going to do it, I'll take it. All right, so we're just going to get one quick casual 
and then the tournament is going to start. Our first match here, well, right now, is just, uh, it's GEVSM Fantasy Zero versus GE Drew. I actually wrote Miles, and I didn't mean to do that. Phil, what's the address here? Do you know it? 413. Let me see the check. Can you type the address into the chat? There is the address. Here is the address right here. No, can you just type it in the chat so he can write the address down? He can write it down like that. Uh, he can see this? Yes. This is the address. Show him the address. Okay, here's the address to Valley Stream. Now, I will take a large pie with pepperoni, ham, and bacon. Damn. I'm starving. Is he really going to get me a pie? Don't troll me. If you're really going to buy me a pizza, I'll take it. What, what's the closest pizza place to here, Phil? Phil, what's the closest pizza place to here? Papa John's or... Ancona. Do they deliver here? I believe they will, yeah. It's really interesting. How about like Pizza at Domino's? Places you can order online from. Yeah, so they could do a Pizza Hut or a Domino's. Pizza Hut's around here? Uh, there's a Domino's, I think. Domino's? Wait, hold on, I'll find out right now. Let me pull up my application here. Put the address back up, Let's see. Hold on. There is a Papa John's, actually. You can actually order a Papa John's. It's 1.2 miles away. I will take Papa John's. Large pepperoni, ham, and bacon. Pepperoni, ham, and bacon. I'll greatly appreciate it. Free Tom Brady autograph trading card to this guy. I'm serious. I'll send him an autograph Tom Brady trading card. Just a regular crust. What kind of crust do they have? Does anyone know? Hey, hold on a second. Does anybody on this stream happen to know if... I guess just regular crust. It's just regular crust. If they ask, it's regular. It ain't easy doing commentary. You end up starving until you're done. No, we're putting more cal. We're putting it on. There was an issue with the uh, console. By the way, Digimon. Yeah, that'd be it. 1.2 miles from here. Digi, by the way, the four worst characters, in my opinion, in, in from top to bottom, would be Scorpion... Shiva, Jade, Kano. So that would mean Shiva is third to worst in the game. 
MK is actually tomorrow, Pig. This is just uh, caliber and... Yeah, so um, Shiva's third worst in the game, man. So I I'm on your side with the Shiva sucks. Tournament time. I mean, she's got parlor tricks, but... Uh, she's got tricks, but I mean, at the highest level, when you know how to w get around those tricks. Okay, guys, we're going to start this tournament up. I, mean, I don't care how good your Shiva right. is, at the highest level, you're going to get bodied by a top Kung Lao. You're not going to be a good Shiva player and beat PL's Kung Lao. Not going to happen. Not in tournament. Absolutely not. What's wrong with the game? First to three. First to three. Because it's only a five man turn. Uh, because, because this is uh, only a five man tournament, we are playing every match. First to three. So we're going to have Haitian Sensation against EMP Royal Lance. Pepperoni, bacon, yeah, Canadian, but yeah, ham, that's it. That's right. You got it. That's right, brother. Kano can just up ball, right, when she did us her, her telestomp, and, and she can't do shit about that. He recovers too fast. So doing a practice game here. Yeah, that's correct. The Canadian bacon, pepperoni, and, and uh, bacon. And yeah, you got it, brother. Okay, so we're doing a practice game here, making sure everything is working properly before we get the tournament underway. Make sure everything's working fine, and then we're going to get right into the tournament. And Kano used to be so good with that up ball. I think, I think NRS should apologize. No players. All right, so guys, after today's tournament of uh, today's so today's Soul Caliber tournament, <coughs> um, this is just a test match, guys. This is not real tournament at the moment. Um, after today's Soul Caliber, we are gonna do the third strike challenge, followed by, if we've got some time, some MK Casuals. Battle 
I'm going to go get sweet Johnny Cage to come in here and call this with you. I don't think they do ask for ID. They just deliver the pie. And thank you so much for that, by the way. Hey, do you go to any tournaments at all? Do you go to any of these tournaments? If you do, I'll buy you a drink, man. I see you at one of these events, man. Me and you are going to the bar. First drink's on me. Okay, so... Okay, so here goes our first game. Uh, I gotta send this guy a Tom Brady. I tell you what, man. PM me your address on Test Your Might. I'll send you a Tom Brady trading card autograph. Oh, okay, thanks, man. Wait, uh, do you live in Chicago at all or no? Okay, so here we go. Okay, so here we go. This here is tournament. Yes, it is. Game one. Right, and Royal Lance looking uh, very strong right away. Royal Lance is uh, the Hill Day player. Patient Sensation making a comeback, though, trying to make something of this round. While standing A plus B, closes it out. Ah, oh, Kansas City. Ah, oh, good B throw there by Royal Lance. This is Shang Wah. That's what I thought the first time. Okay, so I was a little bit confused there. Royal Lance is actually okay. Laisha. And looking like taking that next round. Oh, wall standing B E X. Oh, I should say Brave Edge, actually. It's a Brave Edge while standing B. There we go. Now he's escaping those stuns. Didn't escape those stuns in casuals. Escaping them now. Very interesting. A little sandbagging going on, maybe? You see that a lot in Guard tournaments. crush? Guard break, I should say. Wow. Kills him with a 2K. Very nice. Okay, so here we go. AAB catches him in the back. 3B blocked. 2A whiff. Little wall standing B. Oh, he's been catching him with that guard break. And a ring out. Good guard crush to a ring out there. So Royal Lance going up one to nothing in a best out of five. One BB, good A punish. 2 2 B. Wow, he is not getting around that. I guess not want to take the chance. Try to go under it. Oh, just not as... Misses the combo. Ring out by Royal Lance. Wow. He already gave them a $4 tip, so you don't, uh, don't let him fool you at the door. Wow. Thank no you. ETA, but he just ordered it. Thank you very much. Getting, oh, there we go. Two ways under that. Scott, his guard meters are flashing red now. Not full red, but... There we go. Now we got full red here. Can't really block too much. And Royal Lance has a bar of meters, so if he gets guard broken here, it's going to be a problem. Oh, guard breaks him. Very nice.
does not really complete the combo. Got the guard break and got a meter. He probably could have done a soup. Could have done a soup to there. Wow! It breaks the throw. Still takes damage on a late throw break. Probably should have gone ahead and done a super there and got the win. Instead, Haitian Sensation lives another round. Oh, full charge, 2B plus K. Alright, uh, AAB. Good B throw into the wall. Does not escape the stun. Gets hit by a super. So now. I don't know Tom Brady. I'd like that ESPN commercial. The guy will come in here. Tom Brady? Yeah, that's me. Michael Jordan? Careful with those wires, yeah, Brady. I'm just trying to. Got them old knees like me. Did have two surgeries. There we go. Guaranteed super. It's going to survive it, though. 4 4 B whiffs. Uh, whiffs the 4 4 B 2 A. A A B. Guaranteed. A A B. Unsafe. Hilda can punish it. So one, one game one of peace. One to now. one here. You are watching for the first time wow, ever. No stun escape again. Missed the combo, though. So you guys are watching for the first time ever. Soul Calibur 5 on the Combat Network. Indeed, indeed we first, are. This is the first time on Combat Network that we have done something that is not either Mortal Kombat or Killer Instinct. Very true. Wow, there we go. I know that. Here we go. Standing B, 2-2-B. Two, two whiffs, no whiff punish. Wow. Two big whiffs, no whiff punish there. He's really eating him up with that string there. Charge AA. Uh, good throw there. A throws there. Mixes oh it up. Wow. All right. So Haitian Sensation one round away from going up two to one after what looked like a sandbag first victory out of uh, Royal Lance. You know, in casuals, Royal Lance was kind of blowing them up here. Um... I think Haitian Sensation may have realized exactly the stuff that he, he doesn't know how to get around. I think he's kind of abusing that right now. All right. Like I said, all I see are flashy things. Lots of hit sparks. Oh, uh, good throw break there. Oh, whiff there. Good. Oh, he could have punished him with a 3B there. Does not. And Haitian Sensation, as a result, is still alive. Wow, this could be a big mistake, not getting that whiff punish there. Wow, is that it going to be it? No, and it yes, is. Yes, two to one, Haitian sensation. Wow, I'm I'm surprised there. Could have had a good whiff punish there. Does not whiff punish with 3B. Good throw there. Oh, good, there we go. Good whiff punish. Ring out. Wow. Tries to duck the throw. Started throwing him. Ready was going to duck. Rings him out. Wow, AAB? From behind, does not get all the hits. Digi, I really appreciate that shout out. We are, in fact, yes, very supportive of the entire fighting game community, including all the Capcom games, Namco games, everything, pretty much. Uh, big shout out to uh, Filthy Rich for sending me uh, codes, actually, for uh, for Dom Pierre in this game. We actually haven't unlocked him in the uh, tournament, even though he's tournament legal. Nobody uses him right now, so I'm not that terribly concerned. So. Uh, if you play Soul Calibur, I may actually have a code for you. We'll see. A little later on, there'll be a giveaway. Shout out to Filthy Rich. We do appreciate that. Yes, and at some point the next time he's in New York for a tournament, if we're running one, he's going to come by and maybe play a little Tekken on stream. Oh, you're excellent. You're going to have to get down with him. I'll play him. Oh, so again, dude, again, this Haitian sensation really taking advantage of, you know, uh, uh, Royal Lance not escaping these stuns here. I don't know if he knows that. And ring out. Wow, that's a it. ring out. So that is it. Three that's to one. Three one. Haitian sensation advances over Royal Lance. Very nice. Step into a ring out. Blocks the three B. Okay, so coming up, we have Young Fox 
versus GEVSM Fantasy Zero. Probably the best uh, uh, Soul Calibur player here at VSM. So we'll see how he fares against outside competition. Now I just want to touch on that now. That last uh, when they were playing in casuals, Royal Lance was doing a lot of following up A A B on block with three B. Yeah, and uh, that guy, Haitian Sensation, was letting him get away with it. Now, I don't know if he was sandbagging or eventually caught on to it. But right there, he, he, he was punishing for it every single time. Um, uh, and right there, he, he reads that he was going to do uh, AAB and a 3B. He doesn't, doesn't push, try to respond. He just blocks, blocks a 3B. Uh, then he steps, B throws him out. And, uh, you know, Royal Lance uh, was not doing a good job of breaking any grabs. Uh... Or even escape any stun. So really, really abusing um, the stuff his opponent was not getting out of there. So very nice. Guys, is this go? Button check. We got All button right, just, check a, going on just a quick button check so you guys are going to get another quick commercial. Well, a quick ad. Make sure, guys, that you check out Clockwork Technology. You can check them out and look for their Core 1000 custom PC built for Diablo 3 coming out this Tuesday. Check them out, HTTP, clockworkit.net, and check them out on Clockwork It Out on Twitter. All right. So, wow, free nine is just a McDonald's machine today. I don't know what free nine's heart thinks of him right now, but it can't be good. You know, you know what I'm loving here. I'm watching. I'm looking at Dark Rob right now, and Dark Rob, he's been up. He's been up way too early today, but he is still here and supporting and watching some of the MK MK guys. Play MK casuals on the setup. He, he was playing the Vita earlier. Now yes. keep in mind, not only is Dark Rob here, but he has a sword at home that he is oh, now making right. play from. Okay, all right, he's got a sword at home. Now that's what's important, right? The sword. We are anxious to get back to the sword. Oh, see, now we could have had live Soul Caliber if he had brought his two swords. Unfortunately, I don't think that's legal. Oh well, all right, my bad. <laughs> okay, so we got Big Beaky here. Beaky, you want to call some matches here? You know Soul Calibur. Come on, get on the mic. Are you serious? Wait, what? What? This is the actual character? Yeah. This is a legal character. I know, but that's his main character? Yes. Uh, the female Mokujin is his character. Elysium is his real character. Okay. He is good with Elysium. You'll see. Elysium is... There's no being good with Elysium. It's just now she's Hilde. She's like a female Mokujin. She... Changes characters from round to round. Goes in the prep there. Oh, very nice. Gets the super up too. I may be eating my words here. He's Hilde. I don't know if he's familiar with using Hilde. See, it, it, now if he loses Not escaping here, the stun here. He's got wow. to escape. If, if he loses, he's, he's, he's checking right now. He's testing with, with Elysium. Um, now, Viola is a character he knows how to use. Okay, so he's Viola now. <laughs> playing Elysium is kind of uh, sketchy in a way. She does have her own super, though. She does not inherit the super of the character. 3B. Goes into prep. And then there's a fade out. Oh wow, fade out. Okay, so CI one one out. nothing young fox. Miles. Fantasy Zero, also known as Miles. I uh, I have a feeling we may see either Tira Tira or yep, Tira. I've seen him use Tira. He's pretty good with Tira. Um I've seen him use Tira, I've seen him use Watcher. Oh, can you unhook that? Right. Okay, so I got, I got, I got. Now he knows how to use Tira. While standing B, and he also knows how to use Natsu, so I wouldn't be surprised to see that later too. 
But not really punishing him at all here for anything he's doing. Can't let him get away with murder here. Wow. That is going to be it for the round. I'm not really sure if he knows how to deal with Raphael at all. 2B. That's 1-1-K, one, one I believe. Two two B. Wow, and young. Fox. Wow, in convincing fashion. Yes, right now, young going Fox. up two nothing. Two nothing. Well, two nothing in the match. In the match, yeah, in the, the rounds. <laughs> and certainly has a nice lead here again. Wow, big punish. Doing some good whiff punishing there. Oh wow, prep into into a uh, K. Some trouble here. Blocks the low, no punishment there. Wow, and that is it. Two nothing. Two Young nothing Fox. so far. Fantasy Zero gonna have to do something. I oh, was just pointing out, Dark Rob, how you don't have your sword here. Dark Rob would be here playing Soul Calibur, the live game. Rob, come on over here and tell everybody why you have this sword. I'm just saying, I think everybody should be allowed to walk around with a sword strapped to their back. Um, if zombies come in here, man, we're done for. We, we don't we, have any protection against zombies, We don't zombies, have any man. protection from zombies. But I have this very razor-sharp sword that will lop a zombie's head off like, like nothing. But I didn't think I was allowed was to carry it out public. Again. So if zombies come and get us, we're, we're, just, we're done for. Just accept it. So yeah. Viola, I would probably say, is the yeah, best character I've seen look the best. But he's not escaping stuns. Um, neither one of these guys so far today here have been escaping stuns or... Or even two on point on their throw breaks. So going back to uh, Viola here, the character he's had the most success with so far. Yeah, I would say that. Oh. 6-6-V six, six there. Good throw. Oh, he's got him up in the air. This yeah. is going to do damage. Goes for K out of prep. Oh, fades out. He could have escaped. No, actually, he can't escape that. Never mind. He survives the super, but not the follow-up. That's fun. You couldn't escape. I don't that's, know. That's, that's fade out, son. You can't escape on counter. Anymore. Tom Brady, you got to tell me. How do you feel about playing in garter belts like that? Could you do it? In what? Could you fight in garter belts the way she does? No. Yeah, neither could I. They wouldn't fit me. Me either. Gonna get some life back here. Oh wow, he totally falls for the second hit of the strain. Gonna throw him here, is he gonna bring him out? And he does. Taking advantage of the fact that he knows his opponent is not very efficient on throw breaking right now. The one thing uh, gonna follow up here. The one thing fades out. Oh, good stun there. The one thing I'll say about Fantasy Zero right now, he's playing a good game of staying away from the edge, at least so far. There's a B throw. It's going to bring him out. At that time, though. Got to break that. It's got to be B. I think it's B. might be A, but I think it's B. I totally forget. Either way, you've got to always be conscious to break that one. He's not really doing a good job of stepping in as with Raph. He's trying to play a vertical game with Raphael. If you're going to try to play Raph... And, uh, try to play a vertical game against Raph. No whiff punish there. He's in trouble here. Back to the edge. And that is it. Perfect. Fantasy Zero goes down 3 nothing. So Young Fox advances. And now we're going to have G.E. Drew versus Haitian Sensation. In the meantime. In the meantime. Commercials. Commercials. Can I use this, please? When do you need it back?
Well, I, I would need it. Uh, so I don't have a converter for that tournament, uh, whatever it is. Um, I have no way to practice on the pad I have to use at uh, UFGT. Like basically, if for tomorrow I need to practice on the pad I have to use at UFGT, and I don't really have a way to do that. Um, okay. Okay, thanks. Okay, thank you. Okay, so this is winner's semis. <laughs> you guys good? Okay, button check right now. Fight. You really can't fight a vertical game against Ref. Ref is very good at playing vertical, so if you're trying to fight, play a vertical game against a, uh, uh, a Ref player, it's um, going to be a pain in the ass. All right, so just a quick little button check here. I should have entered this tournament. So, so Tom Brady, how do you like the uh, how do you like the the name bars for uh, the other fighting games that are non MK? Uh, I like them. All right, so we're going to have Nightmare versus Hilda here. Now, Haitian Sensation, we saw he's got a good game with, with Hilda. Jeannie Drew getting in there immediately. Oh, a blockable though. stomp. Uh, I don't really think he's going to break either of the throws, so... So I don't really think he has to vary his... To a, he's a low A or low B throws. Probably just could just push him to the edge if he wanted to. A big whiff, nice punish there. Got his back to the edge here. And oh, good. And, and you notice, you see how he escapes the stun there. Uh, so you know, if this, if he, is, if, if Drew ends up escaping his stuns here, this guy Haitian Sensation is going to have some problem getting his damage because, for the most part. Uh, here we go. Good parry. No, it does not fall for the bait there. Because uh, for the most part, this guy, Hayes Sensation, is getting a lot of damage on people not escaping the stunts. So he gets a lot of unguaranteed damage. And, you know, GE Drew, I've watched him and I've watched uh, Fantasy Zero play since the game came out. Um, and the both of them are very good. I mean, I know Fantasy Zero isn't really practiced right now, but, you know, he should be getting casuals in over on the other, uh, over on the other side anytime he can. Because uh, I, I know he can definitely play better than he did. Um, so, uh, Drew going up one nothing on Haitian Sensation. Winning this match will send him to the winner's final. Oh, against Young Fox. Big whiff punish there. Good jumping V. Both players kind of spacing out a little bit. Comes in, standing K. Oh, and a good uh, Grimstride uh, attack there. Oh! Unblockable stomp. See if he can make a comeback. Wow! What a big comeback there. That was huge comeback. He got caught with that. He got caught with a thing out of Grimstride. And there we go. Good damage there. Let's see if he can uh, hold on to it this time. Or we'll see if G. Drew makes a comeback here. And that'll be it. Perfect. Wow. All right. Escape that stun, man. Fight. Parry, is he going to catch him? No, he does not. Does not take the bait again. Wow. Doesn't kill him, though. Such damage, though. Goes into a... Oh, wow. He stays alive there. He does not fall for the Grimstride mix-up. He's learned not to respond now. Oh, 
I think that's 4AA actually right there. Got him in the corner there. Good throw break. Oh, big whiff. Big whiff. Is he going to punish him? There we go. For a second, I thought he was going to miss the punish there. I thought he was going to be a little too late on it. 3A, 2A. Unblockable stomp. Got to get off that edge. Got to get off that edge. It's not rolled properly. Good throw. Wow. Can it, will this be a comeback here? Oh, does not kill him. Has not killed him yet. Probably. Oh, big whiff. And he punishes the whiff. Very nice. Okay, so this match has turned into a game here. Yes, it has. Oh, another big whiff. Tremendous damage there. Again, you can probably escape that. He was hunting that big, uh, that big damage right there. Oh, wow. He nice eye. He's got it. I don't know why he's not doing that to the edge. This guy has not been really breaking any. Neither of these players have really been good on their throw breaks. Wow. Um, there we go. He finally crouch blocks it, and these guys will take it. So Drew going up. GE Drew up 2 0 right two now. 2 0. GE Drew looking real solid. 3 AA. Charge A. And back to the wall, rolls off the edge though. BB, 3AA, 3A2A, I should say. I don't know why, I just love that throw. Wow. Catches him with uh, stance B, stance 3B, I should say. So up one round to nothing here. Grim strides in. He, I don't know why he's doing the throw away from the edge. Doing the low throw away from the edge. Throws him to the wall. Now, Hayes' sensation is, oh, he was flashing red, now in yellow. Wow. KO. Putting the pressure on him early here. Got back to the edge. He get, wow, just decides to not even try to block or tech the throw. Decides just to go ahead and do a charge B attack. Throws him, does not get, Oh, unblockable stomp again does not avoid it. Is he going to kill him? Oh, good low block. Wow. Three hit string. Caught him with the okie yeah, doke. He was reading high. That's a three hit string. Four AA, three A and a two A. Good block there. Good guess. Oh, totally big whiff on the combo there. Drops the combo. See if that comes back to haunt him. Throws him back toward the middle of the ring. That throws him the other direction. Ah, uh, this might be a mistake here. He could have stepped that. Now, H sensation here. When he sees that setup, can step. You can actually step that super. Oh, wow. All right, so two to one. Two to one. Haitian sensation coming back into it here. GE Drew up two to one. B throws him, got it back to the edge. Oh, uh, wow. Put us back to the edge again. Very convincing round there by G.E. Drew. Oh, comes in right away. He's starting there. He starts the round almost the same way almost every match, and, and Hayes and Sensation is not really able to whip punish him. Got us back to the edge now. Got a pretty commanding life lead. Is he going to be able to make this back? And he rings him out. Wow. You've got to be able to break those kind of grabs. You've got to know these characters only have one grab that'll ring you out with their back to the edge or forward. It's a lot of the times you're not really caught in a mix-up situation when it comes to throws in the ring out. 
Is that it? And A rings him out. So three to one. Three to one. Okay, so GE Drew advances to the winner's final. Coming up, loser's bracket matches. You want to just run GE Drew and Young Fox? We're here? All right, we're going to run the loser's bracket now. So what do we get here? You want to run EMP, Royal Lance, and... Uh All right, coming up, Royal Lance and Fantasy Zero. If anyone wants to know, MK players we have here, we have myself, Dark Rob, we have Insuperable, and Insuperbro. Damn, I don't count as an MK player? You don't play. I don't count as an MK You're player? You're the Shang Tsung of New York. I'm, I'm still an MK player. No, I mean MK9, I mean. All right. You're an MK player. It's MK9. So we got button checks going on. And when the players are set to go. Guys, I need 20 seconds. All right. Commercial. So guys, part of this match, and the last one actually, is partially brought to you by the Gamer's Edge, because, well, <laughs> both Miles and uh, Drew are sponsored by the Gamer's Edge. So make sure you check them out. Alright, let's get to the matches. Okay, so here we're going to see probably the Alicia by uh, Royal Lands, by EMP Royal Lands. And let's see who Fantasy Zero is going with. I didn't see who selection was. And he's going with Pira. Ah, oh, and it's to the Ezio tune. I love the Ezio song. This is one of the best songs in this game. It's not the best. This is one of the best fighting game songs I've ever heard. I strongly suggest you guys download this song. This is one of the best tracks I've ever heard in a fighting game. Just an unbelievable soundtrack for this game. You know, do you know what everybody is missing right now? No. Anybody who is not here is not getting the opportunity to eat my wife's brownies. That is true. Two, uh, six, six A, one A A, two B, or not two B. It goes and go goes ahead with two three six B there. You said it. I had no choice. I know. I know. It was a uh, 3-3-B there, right? The EX, uh, Brave Edge 3-3-B, I should say. Uh, Brave Edge while standing, B there. And just a lot of this guy, Royal Lance's tricks is not really working out for him here. Guys, there will be MK casuals later on. We got to get through Soul Calibur and then the third strike count. 2-3-6-A-A. -A. Uh, good back throw there. Uh, whips a beat, uh, 2 BB. Wow, 2 3 6 B out there. Just for the unblockable toilet. We have good throw break. Tries to finish with 1 AA, second hit whiffs. Catches him with the low there. And he connects the super. 1AA knocks him down. Misses the 2BB on wake up. Right in for a super. 6BB, 6B charge B I should say. 
totally avoided there. And finishes him off with the Brave Edge 3 3 B. AAB, good punish there. 236B is guaranteed when she blocks AAB. Miles had a commanding lead. 236B blocked, but no punish. The battle battle to fight. 6BB. Number 2 2B. While standing, B. 3B there. Oh, wow. Good one, AA. Uh, catch them with uh, 4 AAA. It's either 4 or 4 4. I don't remember. I forget. Uh, 2 2B. Whiffs 3B. Goes to the unblock, which also whiffs. Whiffs 2 2BB. Uh, two and is punished. A whole lot of whiffs here. Oh, comes in a good throw. A lot of whiffs from both of these players here in this particular match. Uh, whiffs is 1BB. No punishment there, though. 2BB blocked. No punish there. 4 uh, B plus K there. Wow, big whiff on that. Another big... Wow, no punish... I'm pretty sure you can AA that. Got him in flashing red though, so let's see if he can. Now I wouldn't try to kill. I would try to beat him with throws. I would try to beat him with a throw here, or just beat him without breaking his guard. There, you don't want to break his guard. You want to save the guard break uh, for this round or the last round if needed. There we go. Breaks his guard. Is he gonna? Is he gonna super him? He does not super finish him. Uh, Brave Edge while standing B. Grounded one AAA. With the super, no punish there at all. Again, that's that's full. Wow, not punishing the AAB with two three six B. That was the mat. That was the the match there. B B A A A B. Three B catches him back dashing. Wow. One AA, I mean one BB, I should say. Brave Edge while standing B. Is Young Fox here jumping into the commentary? Got Young Fox over here in the microphone. Again, that's punished by AA. No punish there. Yeah, Pierre's getting away with a lot of punish. Another BB again. There's a stuff. That is the first, one of the first uh, stun escapes we've seen here today. People here not really on point so far in this tournament with escaping stuns or uh, grab. 6BB. He's getting a lot of miles out of that 6BB. Getting a lot of miles out of it. Or 6B full charge B, which he was doing. Which is again. steppable, though. Yeah, steppable, and you can crouch the full charge version. Yep. 2-1. Two 2-1. One. Two one. Fantasy 0. No, he can't change. Oh, yeah, he walk. Yeah, he can change now. Now, I would stick with... I would not do this. I mean, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. And, and it didn't look like it was broke, so. He must really like that CE. He must. And on top of that, you had Ezio stage music. I mean, you just totally ruined everything now, man. <laughs> and, and, man, yeah, the Ezio stage music. What is this guy doing, man? Oh, okay, here. so he starts out again with the same, with uh, Lexi Alexia. Lacia Lacia match. Lacia I'm just going in. Well, goes sitting on block. Well, totally whiffs there. Good, Good throw there. Edge. 6B. Oh, guard cross. Oh, no. Getting the miles out of it. No step. AAB. Really -A there we go. He could have 2 3 6 b there. Didn't have to do AA. I mean, I think he could have AA. Yes. I, mean, yeah. I'm, I'm, I don't know why I'm thinking he's still here. I'm a still caliber 4 player. I always think Sophie when I see this bitch, man. I <laughs> If he would have stayed pure, that would have been a 2-3-6-B, but now Tira now. Big whiff by both people. Yeah, Pierre, uh, Tira is one of his characters, that is correct. 
getting good miles out of that. I mean, he really is. Brave Edge, yeah, does a wall standing uh, B Brave Edge. Tayane special. AAB. 2K to death. 2K takes the round. One round apiece here. And it's going to be Ivy now against Laisha. Again with the 6-6-B. Does a 2-2-B there. Oh, good throw there. That unblockable is very good when people like to get up right away from that range because it's mid, can't step it. Really good tech crash. So yeah, you really got to be careful how you get up against Ivy. Oh, big whiff there, Ooh. but it ends up paying off for him, but not able to finish up on the combo. And he's got two bars here. What is that move? Uh, Brave Edge 4B? What is that move that she does? The uh, Ivy's move. From Ivy? Yeah. Um, Brave Edge 4B or is that 6B? I think it's 6B. The Brave Edge 6B. Yeah. yeah, Brave Edge 6B. Didn't abuse it there. Had two bars. That was a really good time to abuse it, especially... Goes into Natsu now. It's a hard move to abuse, though, due to the fact it's step up midway. But at this... Uh, you got to test his knowledge for it, yeah. I mean... I'm going to be honest, with full bars on both ends, I'd be tossing out some GIs. Goes for the unblockable, and he pulls it out here. It is now match point for Fantasy Zero here. And Viola, wow, gets all getting round robin all through his characters here. He seems to play a lot of girl characters, so I guess I can see why he would play Elysium, because he does seem to play a lot of the girls. That doesn't mean you play girl characters. Kind of. Now keep in mind, Elysium does keep her own super. She does not inherit the super of the character. Brave Edge while standing B into AAB. 3B block. BB, oh, a good, could have ducked the high there the first time. Good throw to end around. Damn. That's it, right? That's it. EMP, Royal Lance. So, All he right, Haitian sensation. Haitian sensation. We got a rematch now here. No, they didn't play this. No, it's uh, this not a rematch. To go to losers final. Okay, so this is loser semis. Where is Haitian sensation? There he is. Okay, we need. So we're going to have Haitian sensation on here. And uh, EMP Royal Land seems uh, very upset here. Ah, uh, this guy right here. Haitian Sensation. EMP Royal Land seems very upset there. I mean, um... I'm waiting for his Haitian to come out with the new Hilde loop. He's been practicing it forever and he really wants to uh, debut it in this tournament. I mean, uh, overall, you know, versus his Pira, he wasn't stopping 4 AAA, was not blocking the low, uh, wasn't punishing any 3Bs. Wow, is it? Wasn't punishing no, just, 3B at all? Just to be serious, um, the pizza has arrived for Tom Brady. So it actually did get ordered, and it is here. Thank you very much. Quick yeah. button checks. Ordering a pizza for Tom Brady. <laughs> Thank you very much. Hold on one second. Hold on one second. Report, guys, hold on. Show it to the camera. Show it to the camera. Uh, there we go. <laughs> we do have pizza here. You can see him. Yeah, you guys are up. Oh, and he got me a so Wow, and a Pepsi. Oh, that's legit right there. Thank you. Wow. Thank you. Phil, go ahead. Help yourself too, man. Not near that. Oh, you got you. Help yourself too, Phil. Get yourself. Getting in with 66K. Where's Dark Rob? Rob! Oh. 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 
Still just trying to zone out. Natsu is not really working too well. Bowling for the bombs. That's the one thing you have to block in this matchup, no matter what happens. Ooh. Hates the sensation. You're really going to have to space out Natsu better in this round. No whip punish. Going for the possession mix up from Natsu. Okay, so we've got. Six six eight six six B Brave Edge. It's so dirty. Has to go into possession there. Good whip punish. A uh, good B throw. That's a B throw, right? Yeah, that's a B that throw. Is B. Okay. You can escape that, can't you? You can save old old grabs. You could have. I thought. I thought. Yeah, yeah. the man grabs only give you. A yeah, this guy hates his sensation. Has been getting. No, I mean uh, that stun there. The uh, C two B stun, right? Or yeah, that's is just a uh, uh, check trap. But he's getting a lot of mileage out of gamut that's not really guaranteed so far in this particular yeah. tournament. I'll punish. There we go. That is uh, negative six, four. You can actually two A out of that. Now that's not safe. But can they punish that? What? Um, that a B B. A, yeah, A B B B. Yeah, it's negative twelve. So what does she get? A A or or four A plus K? Yeah. Four A plus K she gets. I believe so. Okay. That's her fastest move. I know that. So. Again, oh. that, that's not guaranteed. But he's getting, like I said, he's getting a lot of mileage. He's trying to, to keep things simple. To escape stun and caliber, you just got to touch four points. Some people. You just hold guard and do a 360. Especially now, because you're never going to get an accidental GI. You can yeah. just hold guard, do 360, escape it every time. Unsafe. Sometimes games like Still Calibre 4, you'd get an accidental GI, but. I do like the readjustment to the GI system in this game, though. You have to be honest. Oh, here we I go. Mean, Good unblockable. And that's going to do it. Game one. He has to start getting up with a button if he's just going to be abusing unblockables all day long. And Hayes' hey, sensation is really getting a lot of mileage out of setups that are not guaranteed here. And he's going to switch. Is he going to switch the stage? or? I'm pretty he sure he's a, a loyalist, so it's more like it's a stage switch. Um, maybe trying to get a stage that's easier to ring out, and he does get one. But people are not taking that uh, B grab so far, so I mean... Why not? Battle one. Fight. A A? That, what is that move there, right there? Is that while standing A plus B? No, that's two A plus B from... Uh, two A plus B, okay. Yes. That's great tech crowd. Used to be here while standing attack in... Uh, okay, two A plus B. That's a pretty fast punishment too. How many frames is that move? Oh, that one I don't remember off the top of my head. Sorry. No, not blocking the bomb there. Not blocking or... Eight or eight B, none of the above there. You can just take the bomb. They only do like ten damage when you're on the ground. If you really don't want to worry about the mix-up. That's not guaranteed, right? No, that's guaranteed. That that one is guaranteed. Yep. The and afterwards, oh. you can do the. Um, the well, if that's done. That's guaranteed. Yep. But if the other one where you're standing, I know you can escape that area. Uh, yes. And he's getting a lot of mileage out of that. That oh, that's done in a super. Oh, good tech there, but tech's at late, does lose the life. Can he make a comeback here? Uh, that's it! That should be a game. That should be a round. That's it! Into the female version of the Azuna drop. <laughs> I'm not really sure who had what first. If Hayabusa had the Azuna, or if she had, or Taki had that. I know Ryu I came first. That kind of. Did Taki hit it? But did he have the Azuna and Ninja Gaiden? I mean. Oh man, I haven't played Ninja Gaiden in so many years. I don't even remember. He didn't have the Azuna and Ninja Gaiden, I don't think. I don't think he had it on the ones in the arcade, no. Did did Taki have that in Soul Calibur 1? I don't think she Soul, did. Hold on, did she have it in Soul Edge? Because that would definitely She had it in Soul first. Edge? I, I don't think so. she did. She did? Yeah, I don't know. It's been so long since I played that man. game. <laughs> but DOA 1 is 95, though, so hold on. Well, Soul Edge is even... Soul Edge, Soul Edge is right around there. Yeah, it was like 95, 96, right? Could be a tie. <laughs> that would make it the, w the woman's Azuna. So match point now for fantasy... No, not is this match point? I think it is match point. Uh, I believe it is match point. 
Oh, bomb. That'll be it. No, this is a match point, is it? Is it a match point? No, I don't think so. It's 2-2. 2-0. Two, 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 two. Yeah, first and three. So it's 2-0 right now. I believe so, yes. Uh, I think a, about a half an hour. That's three, right? It's three, yeah. yeah. Okay. okay, so oh, it was okay. match point. So now we're going to have Young Fox against G.E. Drew. Oh, that'd be me. Right, Wish me luck, stream. Good luck. Where's uh, Blue Nine? And again, thank you so much for this pizza. Thank you so much. I got to give this guy a shout out every stream. The guy that ordered the pizza, what's his name on the stream? So I can make sure I give him a shout out every time I'm on stream. <laughs> 